Hey everyone, it's Marissa. Happy Monday. Hope everybody had a great weekend. Um, I have some sh things to share with you that I picked up during the week and the weekend. So I'm going to get started because it's um, from a few places. So last week I went to um, Michael's and picked up a few things. Um, so let me just share with you what I got there. Their $2 spot last week was, I believe... Um, on sale or I think 50% off I know this week they're 50% off um, for the $2 bin so I picked up these really cute tea light holders um, I didn't get them the last time but I got them this time and they're so super cute so there's two in one box and they had different other um, they had like the different colors like the greens and the blues so I got the pink one, and then I also picked up some of these tags that were on um, sale as well. And there's 18 pieces, so I got the green one and the blue one, as well as the pink one. And then I picked up some more items in the $1.50 section, and um, they were all 50 cents. So I picked up some of these keys. I picked up four of them. Got me a cute little note card with an envelope. Picked up some white doilies. And I picked this up in the clearance section. These are place card, place card holders. These were $1.99, but I figured that I can incorporate them into my projects. And I don't have to use them as place card holders. So I picked that up. And then they have new 6x6 My Mind's Eye paper. So I used my coupon on this one, and this one's by um, Teresa Collins, My Mind's Eye, uh, Vintage Finds. Oops. And um, here, it's a bunch of, um, it's white, there's black, and yellow. But I, the thing I, I liked about this is the yellow is like a mustard yellow, so it's not like a bright yellow. So that's what I spent my coupon on. And then I went back again um, yesterday and picked up a few items. Um, I used my coupon on this classic butterfly because I only have the monarch butterfly. So I thought I would pick this one up and I used my coupon off that one. Uh, I picked this up from my daughter. She Well, she actually picked this one out and um, this is a luggage tag and this was 50 cents. Um... And then their Heidi Swipe, uh, Heidi Swap items are buy one, get one 50% off this week. And you guys, don't let the cashiers tell you otherwise because when I went yesterday, I don't know what's wrong with these Michaels employees. They don't know what's on sale for the week. They should just grab an ad before they start their shift. And I swear they should just go through them because they were ringing up regular price. And um, I told her, no, they're on sale this week. Buy one get one fifty percent off. So she didn't, she didn't believe me. So she had to go call the manager, and the manager came up and she gave like this really like half ass answer. And she was, um, she, the manager actually had to go to the display to read the sign. And then when she came back to the cashier, she um was talking to me, and I told her, no, the ad says, the Sunday ad says that they are buy one get fifty percent off off of the, all of the Heidi Swap items. So she was telling me, yeah, essentially that's that's what it is. So I was just like, essentially, yes or no? So either way, I ended up getting one of the color shines in Primrose. And then um, got the last one of the, the tags. So these are really big, but I thought these were really cool. So I picked that up, and then on, let's see, Friday, Thursday or Friday, I also went to Hobby Lobby, uh, picked up a few things. The trims last week were all 50% off, so I got some more of this tool, um, like tutu tool trim. And then I found, um, they didn't have this the last time. And I know they sell this by the yard, but I've never seen it on the spool. So I thought I would pick it up. 
they have like the polka dot black and white rosette trim and this was half off of $5.99 so I thought that was a good deal so I got it in black and white polka dot got it in the black and then also last week all of their his and hers wedding section items were 50% off as well so I went ahead and picked up more of these super cute tool with pearl beads in it and I bought some for a friend as well so I picked up that and then I also picked up more of these really cute um, it has acrylic flower with some bling and some feathers so I picked up two whites and the two blacks picked up that and then also the paper last week was 50% off so I picked up this one. I don't think I have this one. This is the Authentic Essentials Collection. And this was the last one there. And it's double-sided. So I thought this was a good variety of different types and colors of paper. So that's why I picked this up. So again, I got that for half off last week. And then I finally gave in and bought the flowers the 3d flower by Sizzix and I use my coupon off this because I keep eyeing this but I never did purchase it so finally I gave in and purchased that so that's from Hobby Lobby and then I also Friday night last minute my husband um, wanted to go to Tuesday morning to pick up something he saw in the Tuesday morning ad and lo and behold they had graphic 45 papers there mind you I was there like on Tuesday or Wednesday they didn't have anything so when I went on Friday they had a couple of papers um, I only got one 12 by 12 papers and the rest were like tags so I'm gonna go back and stock them like maybe um, later part of the week maybe Wednesday or Thursday maybe Thursday to see if they have so the only 12 by 12 paper I got was the curtain call collection and I know you guys seen this before but I do not have this I've only probably and this is the back I only probably own two stacks of the graphic 45 paper which is the girls the ladies diary and then now the I think it's the secret garden or something like that those are the only two graphic 45 papers that I I do own so I picked up this one and I know they're probably going to come out with some more at, at Tuesday morning. So I just picked up that. I got the Steampunk Debutante Collection. And these are the, what are these, frames. So I thought this would be so cute to paper piece into projects. Picked up that. And then I was so happy to get this one because this one's so cute. This one is the Springtime Collection Frames. So that's what it looks like. Picked it up, baby. And then last but not least, I picked up the um, Curtain Call Tags, which looks like this. So I thought that I scored on this, and um, I'm going to go back, like I said, to find some more. And so then Saturday, I went to a community yard sale. I only bought one thing, and I bought this pink clock. Um, Rosanna showed that she uh, purchased the one from um, Target, and I know Crafty Chica altered one that she received that she purchased from Target as well. And so I wanted to try and alter a clock too so I saw this they wanted three dollars for it it didn't have a backing or anything so I asked for um, if I can get it for one and she just gave it to me for one so I thought this was pretty cute it's already pink so I'm I'm you know not sure myself if I'm gonna go ahead and try to attempt to color it but I think I'm just gonna leave it as is because I don't want to ruin it so I picked up that and then my order from scrapbook dot com came in and I'm so excited because I finally got my hands on the Prima tags so I got the tag pad by Julie Nutting and these are humongous I didn't realize that they were like so big 
but either way I love them and I can't wait because I don't own the Julie Nutting stamps. I tried to purchase them and they ran out so this is my next goal is to get the stamps because they're so adorable. But I got the tag pad and then I was able to get some of the Prima papers and I am in love with Prima and their papers. So the first one I got was the Lyric Pad. And I know you all have seen this before. So I got the Lyric Pad. And then I also got the Divine. Super cute. So happy I got that. I got Fairy Rhymes as well. And these were, they came out with a lot more new Prima papers. But these were the my three favorite ones. So I got that. And then last but not least. The last paper I got is the Graphic 45 Secret Garden. And my daughter is here causing havoc right now. She just unspooled all of the trim that I just showed you guys. So this is the Secret Garden that I purchased, and it's so super cute. Don't touch nothing, baby. Leave it. No, leave it down there. So... That is my haul from the weekend, or from during the week, course of the week. So, I hope everybody has a great week, and I'll be back with a project share, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Bye.